all right i'm in the final part of this uh, chapter tables and i'm trying to teach you how to add color to the tables okay this all looks very dull and uh, i have deliberately removed some code from here so that we can just focus on the color and uh, you know not on the the table the the entire screen was looking very cluttered and it would have been very difficult for me to explain so let's keep things simple i've deleted some of the code here and uh, what i've done is i have created simple cells and simple all of these are very simple the table is simple the row span and the column span everything is okay we don't have the row span here but i have a column span okay let me show you how to add color to your table okay when you want to add color to your table just find out where you have the table opened up okay the table tag you define the border and the style and width is 90 percent just put your cursor in there and after the semicolon hit spacebar and write background hyphen color double colon b l u e sorry b l u e and uh, semicolon okay and uh, that's it and you need to define color white okay which means the background of this first table no the background no, we're not we talking about this table yeah the background of this table is going to be blue and the color is going to be white let me make sure that i have written down the code correctly the syntax is right all right seems so let me just save this okay and after saving i would like to refresh this page here this there you go okay what i did was i created a background that is blue and i added color that is white okay like this i said that the border is one style 90 percent width background color blue and color is equal to white that's pretty much it even in the border you can add color you could play with that and uh, you could also add you know you could limit to where this is placed for example i don't want color of the font to be blue or white here Control x okay what i really want is i want this to be implemented here in this row just simply add it here Control v background color let me add a space here so that you can see clearly in the second row i added background color blue and color white let me go ahead and save it okay okay i tried to run the code but just to explain it to you this will not work here the table row won't change its color specifically because this is the limitation of the html language and this is where the css comes to play okay and uh, i'm just going to go and put this code back and uh, i want this blue again all right another way that let me just save it okay when i save and run the file i'm back to the blue color but when i was trying to just add blue color to the specific rows it was not working the, the code was not working maybe you can try it with inverted commas and maybe the syntax was not correct but what my understanding is that css will help us have more power on the table okay so the next thing that i wanted to show you was how to add a table border okay uh, a color border this is very simple and uh, but this is all done in css as well and uh, the color property within the table border okay so let's just go back to table border one style is equal to width 90 percent and let's change this the background color instead of the background color let's add okay here let's add here the border is equal to style is equal to border okay just let's start with the style we need to change it here 
Okay, let me just delete the entire thing and write everything again instead of just deleting bits and pieces of it. Okay, let me add a space here so that we understand what's going on. So within the table tag, I need you to write style is equal to border. Okay, one pixel. You can say border one pixel solid yellow green. Okay, we have removed the blue background and white text and everything. So we're just adding the border. Okay, and uh, this would make the table, entire table, have a border of yellow green. Table style is equal to border, double colon, one pixel, solid, yellow green, and semicolon and inverted commas close. So I'm going to try and save this. Okay, when I try to run this file, this is what happens. I have a border of yellow green, solid yellow green, but I have lost my cell spacing, but maybe this is what you need. So because I removed the border around the cells, okay, I just added border style. You could continue with the border here. Border is equal to and width is equal to 90% and all of that. I removed that just to show you how you can add a border, color border around the entire table. Okay, if you continue to add more code here, you can easily add border is equal to whatever we added in the last code. Okay, so it was actually border is equal to one and style is equal to width 90%. Okay, you could add these two and uh, get a different dimension you this border here belongs to the style attribute border itself is an attribute as well and it is also an uh, object or a property of a attribute okay so you have border as a property and border as attribute all right with this i'm wrapping up my color video how to add color to tables and uh, this brings me to the conclusion of the entire chapter 5 tables and uh, I'm not going to continue with the exercise for this chapter but I'm going to show you how this can be implemented in real life for example in real life if we are supposed to add a table like this on a website it would look very nice and very meaningful you can add rows and rows of data and uh, it is a nice piece of information nice way to display data a nice way to access information for your users and easier way to be able to make sense out of a lot of information okay so with this i conclude my chapter five and uh, this is what we covered in this chapter just want to make sure that we are yes we did tables we did call span we did row span we did color and we try to understand what nested code is by hitting tab and spacebar so that each table and each row within the table is clearly defined and nested within each other so that when we try to go back and make changes it's easier for us okay see you in the next chapter take care